Just moving on to the lower slated bay roof, which encompasses the living room. Now, the lead work initially has been done to a good standard. This is what we call a cockney flashing. So this is an all-in-one flashing of soaker and flashing. So this is one unit. And normally people cut these straight, which leaves this as a weak spot. But because this has been cut on such an angle, it's been done in a very nice fashion. I appreciate that. Possibly could have done with a little more lap onto the roof. But all in all, really nice work. Now the issue is, as I was saying earlier, about sand and cement being a solid substrate and lead expanding and contracting. So this is just going to come out, though. I don't want to move it too much. But you can see the, the full thing and all this could just fall out very easily. So with the lead, we could... We wouldn't even need to grind it out or knock it out with a hammer, fix it with two lead plugs on each section and then seal it with lead mate, which is especially silicone that moves in conjunction with the lead and this will keep the lead sealed. Now the issue is, as we come around here, you see these sections they don't have ridges on. Ridges on such a small bay are such a bad idea. So what happens is underneath each of these sections is we have a cold free lead soaker. Cold free because it's thinner and this will not allow the slates to kick and it will just sit nicely underneath and each lead section will lap onto the previous and allow a channel. Now what you find when you look here is there is no lead. Oh, that's just come away. So that's been stuck. There's no lead underneath. So it's just going into the property. It must be being saved by some of the old one I felt underneath, I'm not quite sure. But if you look here, Oh, you can clearly see the timbers. There's uh, there's no there's no lead under here. So what we'd need to do is pull off this section, pull off this section, and then slate it back up with the cold free lead soakers. That being said, with the no no felt being underneath, it would be preferable to take the unit off, take all the slates off, new felt, new treated timbers. Put the slates back with the cold three to renew the air because the felt nothing there's no felt coming out and this is the same with the main roof if there's no felt here it means anything that gets under either goes into the roof or runs down the old felt as it always deteriorates along here because it used to sit into here and the bitumen felt slowly degrades and it comes up to around here so anything that gets under falls inside um i would say let's renew it let's keep the slates felt timbers cold free and refix this lead and give it a patination oil treatment as we move on to the flat roof 